wonderful to be with you today. I'm Rev Rach and we're going to begin our worship this morning by lighting our candles. I hope you've got your class candle ready. If not, why don't you press pause and go and collect it. The Lord is here. The Lord is with us. Oh, that sounds like the doorbell. I'd better go and see who it is. <laughs> oh my, it's the green-eyed monster. What do you want? The front door is much nicer than mine. I want your front door. You have a lot more friends than me. Than me, and everyone likes you. You're much smarter than me, and you always get ten out of ten for your spellings. Oh dear, Mr. Green-Eyed Monster. I tell you what, why don't you come on in, and I'll tell you a story all about jealousy. Come on, in you come. Jealousy can lead people to do terrible things. In today's story from the Bible. We're going to hear about two people called Saul and David. King Saul was a bad king and was very jealous of how much everyone liked David. Let's watch that story now. Hey. David was a shepherd who lived in Israel. David was chosen by God to be the next king of Israel when he was just a boy. But David had to wait a very long time until that promise would come true because there was another king of Israel named Saul. Saul was strong and tall and looked like everything a king should be. But Saul did not follow God like he was supposed to. And for that reason, God chose to take the kingdom from Saul's family and give it to David's. David became a great warrior. Arr! and everyone in the kingdom loved David. Huh? This made Saul jealous, and Saul hated David because he thought he would try to kill him and take the throne from his family. So Saul wanted to kill David. Whoa! Oh dear, King Saul got very jealous of David, didn't he? what we can do when we feel jealous. Hmm. Let me have a look in my toolkit. And what tools we're going to find in here that might help us. Ah, oh, here's one. If someone does something well, congratulate them. Ah, oh, well that's a good idea to help with jealousy. So what ideas you can come up with? Why not press pause and tell each other your ideas? As a Christian, I find that talking to God in prayer can really help me to become less jealous of someone. And we'll do that in a little bit, talk to God in prayer. One thing that helps is finding ways that we can work together. We can think about this as we sing our song together called Let Us Work Today. Side by side. 
Find a comfortable position, shall we, in order to pray? <clears throat> Let's pray. Father God, sometimes I get jealous. Help me to find ways to still be a good friend when this happens. Amen. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. Can you carefully blow out your cast candle now? Goodbye!